DCP Player Free. Get it now from digital.net.au. Hi, this is James Gardner, the Senior Tech Geek again, and I'm with Ted Schilwitz uh, again in another interview, but we want to specifically cover NAB. NAB is in about a week's time. It is. And as normal, you usually are there leading the revolution at the NAB and making a lot of noise and being uh, what, what I'd call the um, uh, you're distracting or, or the disrupting the industry. <laughs> yes. Um, so I was wondering what you had to say, what's going to happen this year, what do you, what's, how do you look at NAB this sure. year? Yeah, yeah it's, um, it's interesting because RED was a big part of that disruption at NAB and actually adding a lot of life to NAB, which That's, tends to be kind did. of a, yes. a boring technology yeah. show for the most part, other than a couple little spikes. And That's right. RED was typically a very big spike over the years, there were actually lines and people waiting That's for right. stuff. Yes. Um, and since retiring from RED, I've joined Barco. Watch the other interview, you'll get the whole backstory right, on yeah. that. Yes. But we're at CinemaCon this week, right? right. We're, we're at this Cinemark Theater in Las Vegas. NAB, of course, happens to be in Vegas, too. So we asked our friends at Cinemark if it was possible to keep our special theater installation here in Las Vegas at the South Point Casino. There's, an X, there's a Cinemark with XD cinemas here and the whole thing. And they said yes. Surprisingly enough, they were letting us keep it set up here at at uh, the, the theater. So I'm doing some talks at yeah. NAB. There's a, um, a thing called the Studio Experience. If you do, if you Google Studio instead of EX, just Experience. Yes. I've got a couple of talking sessions where I'm talking about my role as the futurist at Fox and my role at Barco as our cinema evangelist, which yes. is all yes. about promoting this new technology and all these linked worlds about the next generation of entertainment. So, let me get this quickly clear. Yeah. This is staying open for NAB. Yes. And the experience which we've just launched at CinemaCon yes. will be available to all NIT, NAB attendees as well. Is yes, that... but in a, in a special way. Okay. So, so we're keeping this running and we're going to have, an, and we're gonna have um, one showing at NAB. So everybody needs to mark their calendars oh. for the night of April 7th. I'm actually working on buses. You probably have to buses. book it to get in if that's the Yeah, we're going to take um, yeah. a pre, like now that Escape is public and not a secret anymore, um, if you go to the Ready to Escape website, so yes. our web, this is probably the best way to do it. I'm just figuring this yeah. out as we go yeah, here. That's right. um, there's a website that we've launched associated with Escape. Watch the other interview, you'll figure out what yes. we're talking about. Ready, the number two, to Escape. escape. And if com. you, um, put your email in and um, then we'll know to send you information about registering for the NAB um, experience, yes, as it okay. were. It is okay. an experience. Yes, it is. And um, that's the night of April 7th. So the, sh the NAB show itself starts on uh, Monday the 7th. There's the weekend, which I'll talk about in a second, before yeah. the actual, just the that's conference right. is open. Yes. There's a much smaller group there. Yes. But we, that Cinemark said, yeah, keep it. We love what you're doing. We're thrilled. Show it to your technical audience so they can help start thinking about the other side of this yeah. equation, which yes. is building content. Yes. The, the, the shooting, the, the post, workflow. the delivery, all oh, the workflow yeah. stuff, yes. that dreaded workflow oh, that's work. That's right. Well, now we've got this much bigger canvas <laughs> with multiple right. screens, right? Yes. For mainstream cinema. That's right. So I've already met with Technicolor. Um, the folks at Fox are deeply involved in this. There's a post-production super supervisor who has now helped us figure out. We have two wonderful pieces of content from Fox that we're running. Um, the Disney people are helping figure this out. So there's already a group, there's two independent producers that have created content for us. Some of that uh, concert footage that you saw that goes all around you. And there's actually some other stuff that we're gonna show at NAB that we haven't even shown here. Yeah, okay. A piece, a, um, a, a, a very kinetic action adventure scene. I don't wanna give it away, okay, but yep. it's from the guys that shoot all the Red Bull content. So. It's okay. pretty, it's oh, awesome, awesome. Like, yeah. like awesome doesn't even begin to <laughs> well, describe it. Yes. There's two pieces from them. Um, and, and a group up in Seattle that's doing some things with amazing action sports. So you can imagine what that's like, yes, right? Yes. Um, we'll show a piece from my friend uh, Tori from Mythbusters yes, that yes. Um, we showed a little taste of here where we blow a bunch of stuff up. I mean, right, just, yeah. We're having so much fun. <laughs> yeah. We are literally like kids in a candy store that's doing right, this yeah, stuff. It it's fun. crazy. Yeah. And so. I can't wait to show it off. So we're gonna have a long session after NAB closes, it'll start like at 6, 6.30. We'll either have buses or people will get on buses or cabs or whatever, they'll come over here. It's a 10 minute ride from the nice. convention center. And we'll spend the evening going through all this stuff, showing everything we showed at CinemaCon. Yes. Also showing our laser projector, which yes. is this it's brand amazing. new technology that's now deploying. The, the 3D on the laser projector, yep. it's what it should have always been. It's like, um, you have to come and see it. It's very worthwhile seeing laser. 3D projection at 14 foot lamb, it's the same brightness as you see 2D today. Yeah. So our friends at The Hobbit let us use some of the, the uh, 
3D 48 frame, That's which right. we played off the laser projector. That's right. And some of the folks from Hobbit uh, creative team were here with me, and of course I'm friends with them because mm. they use the red cameras, That's we're right. all connected, yeah, yeah, yeah. so it's all it's this one big happy family, <laughs> yes, right? That's right. Um, and they are, like, it was just thrilling to watch them get even more excited than me mm. about finally being able to see their movie the way it was intended, it the way Peter Jackson really it wanted you to, to see be, it. Yeah. It's just genius, right? So we're going to show all that stuff for the NAB audience, not just the CinemaCon audience. So mark your calendars for the, um, the, the night of April 7th. If you find that website, Studio Experience, there's two or three talking points. I'm also talking about virtual reality, which is a big part of my world. Okay. Um, I'm very connected with these guys at Oculus Rift, and I've been spending a lot of time with them. There's okay. been a huge announcement yes. in the midst of all of what yes. we're doing That's about right. them getting Thank purchased by Facebook, Facebook. I know. for a fairly large sum of cash. That's right. So there was a crazy day two days ago when that happened, because I'm connected with these guys, yes, right? Yeah. So they're texting me, congratulating me about Escape, because they're yeah. tracking all the press. I'm texting them going, oh my God, God. this is the most <laughs> unbelievable thing. Yeah. You guys are like, you're flush now. That's you're ready right. to actually go for it. That's right. And they're like, yeah, and it's all blended together. We, we actually, when we, when we spend time with the VR guys, we talk to them about what we're doing with Escape as sort of the gateway drug to the future of every kind of visualization. So I actually believe that where we're headed now yes. is a way to see things in a totally new way. And not just games, that we visualize things in a new way. And this is what you're seeing in a cinema, where we're taking it all around you with our technology, and what you're seeing in a more personal level, where you're taking it all around you with virtual reality. It's just the beginning. Interestingly enough, the guys at Facebook, pretty forward thinking too, said, Let's get this yes. while we can. Yes. We've got the muscle to get this yes. right now, right? Well, they got, and they went for it. They it's got really the muscle impressive. to do something serious with yeah. it too. And we're very excited. That's so I'm looking actually forward yeah. to helping them on some of that as well. So this so is kind of my fantastic. blended world. I have a couple of startups that yes. you think, oh, man, he's busy. Well, yeah, man, yeah, not man. done yet. Do you want to mention them too? Yeah, or? sure, sure. Um, there's a, a thing we're doing called Devil and Demon Strategy, which is another thing. If you go on the website, devilanddemonstrategy.com yeah. or just devilanddemon.com, you can find it. And we have this supercomputer truck. It's connected again. The, the renders that you saw from the first Fox movie um, and this ruined piece that we showed yep. started on the internet and now Fox is developing into a movie. We rendered that on is that our- that that motorcycle sequence? Yeah, that's the oh, motorcycle that, That's my favorite part. It's amazing. Yeah. So we have a supercomputer on wheels that has almost 1,800 cores in it. Oh, and wow. the fastest renders, because that's a lot of pixels when you stretch, this is like, this is like CinemaScope on steroids that's for right, anybody who doesn't is. know what we're talking about. Yes. It's an insane amount of information. The fastest render systems they could do it on were about an hour a frame, which is admirable. On our supercomputer, because it's a real supercomputer, not just a render farm, 11 seconds a frame. Wow. So we were able to actually do it. Is that at NAB? It will be at NAB. Oh. So it'll be parked between the two halls, the supercomputer truck. Let's I've got my VR friends coming to actually play VR games. I'll have to line up to get to see that. And that'll be a line. <laughs> yeah. They're going to talk with me on stage. The Oculus guys will probably be there, and this young group of pioneers on the VR gaming side called Servios will be yeah. there yeah. and showing like you get to kill zombies in a world, it, yep. you, you're gonna, I'll get you to the head of the line and okay. you're gonna freaking love it. I'll love it. Um, I, I may not be able to get him to the head of the line because the line will be so, so big. So <laughs> if you just be nice and say he's press, just let him go because he's gonna talk about it with everybody because people right. are gonna be mad that you're cutting in line, <laughs> right. right? We'll figure out a way. We'll do it after hours that's or right. something. But it's gonna be great. That's gonna be at our truck. Yes. And we're, we have a, a partnership and a connection on the Devil and Demon stuff with AMD, with this huge graphics company. Yes. That, interestingly enough, is powering some of the multiple screen stuff you saw. So everything's all connected. Best Technology is. is a very connected world, right? Mm. So we'll have our Devil and Demon systems, which you can read about on the website and learn the whole thing. We're going to talk about it in NAB. So that's the other part of my life. So wow. I've got Fox, I've got Barco, and man. I've got some startups going on. That's and fantastic. It's well, fun. And well, thank you very much for My giving us a, a nice, fantastic intro of what's going to happen at NAB uh, with Ted and what he's doing. So you know if Ted's involved with it, you know it's the tip of the wave of a revolution coming. So do follow what he's up to, and I can't wait to get to NAB and to, to experience uh, all those new things. So thanks very much, sure. Ted. Sure. I'll give you a couple of email addresses that people can email me directly, and I'll pass it on to the different marketing teams that can help get them connected if they're interested. So so my, my full name, which you just Google because it's ridiculously long, and mm. like ted.shulowitz at barco.com. Yes. But if you want something shorter, tedred at me.com. It's okay. easy, it's That's short, easy yes. and I, you know, red is part of my world, well, it will always be. Part so. of your DNA, That's really. Right. It was part Ted of red is an easy yeah. one, tedred yeah. at me.com. If you email me at, at my barco address or my red, uh, my dot me address, then I'll 
connect you up to coming to the sessions and coming to the theater tonight on the 7th and all that stuff. So okay. it's well, going to be a fun NAB. It will be. Thank you very much, Ted. Sure. Thanks, And James. we'll see you at NAB. Bye for now. Radio.